So naturally, that leads us to the in-season style of training, where a lot of us will have a maybe an indoor season or go from January to end of May or this year to June. What does in-season training look like? Can I lift in-season? The answer is absolutely yes, and you should. Um, Barry Ross, uh, in his book, talks about how Allison Felix on Tuesday maxed out on her deadlift, and then on Thursday and Friday went to the state prelims and finals and set national records. Um, so on, a, on the given weeks and given days that we have, on a Monday through Friday, and again, this is an outline, play with this. Okay, we're going to run, and we're going to lift on Monday. Same style. And you know what? We're going to do hurdle hops. And uh, I like hurdle hops. Coach Kula likes hurdle hops. You can do another and supplement another different style of plyometric. Um, and then again, Tuesday, we're going to run. A lot of us have dual meets on Wednesdays. All right, so you do your dual meet. Um, that is a running workout. That is a hard running workout for your athletes. Uh, this might sound a little crazy. I've actually had, if it's a home dual meet, I've had my athletes finish the meet and then go into the weight room and they'll deadlift and then go home. Um, it's a great running workout. Why not supplement that or complement that with a great lifting workout? Thursday, we're recovering because that's a long week and because we know we have a Friday and Saturday coming up and then our invitational. This is not, as you know, typically what it looks like for us to have a season. Um, it's a week by week or even a phase by phase or what you're trying to utilize and do with your athletes. So, um, you can pair when you lift, when you're not. Maybe you lift instead of on Wednesday. You go on Thursday. No running, maybe just a little lifting. Be smart about it. But the point of all this, and we have more to show you in a second, is, let's go back, is this idea that you can lift during season. I'm just going to say, like, real quick, in the first uh, third of my season, we're going to lift two to three times a week. In the middle part of the season, kind of our competition phase, we're going to lift twice and um towards the championship season our postseason i'm gonna try to lift at least once to two times a week definitely once mostly on a monday because we run real fast on saturdays at invitationals i give them sunday to recover monday we come back we run we lift um my athletes crave it and not only that but if we stop lifting heavy and we stop utilizing mass specific force we've actually seen seen an increase in um slower times and um, more soreness in our athletes. So uh, this might be something you continue to talk with your coaching staff and your athletes, but um, this is kind of taking what we're doing, taking the nuts and bolts, take the, the good of what we're trying to um, reinforce and apply it to your community into your specific training model.